Hey guys, welcome back to Solo Live. My name is Maritza and this is my cousin Sandra and welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that you joined me today because it's a very special day. It's actually my cousin's, not her, but her brother's graduate, get closer, <laughs> graduation. And so here I am going to do her, well, I already did it, but you, know, you get the point. I'm gonna do her makeup for the graduation. So this is it. Subscribe to my channel before <laughs> this video starts. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, so yeah, if you guys care to see how, you know, how it looks, then uh, go ahead and keep on watching. Okay, so we're going to start with moisturizing the face. We're going to use the Lubriderm. Stop laughing! Lubriderm. <laughs> it's in Spanish. To moisturize your face. I really like this <laughs> cream to moisturize the face. She happens to have um, combination skin. So it's dry on the outside and not on the inside. <laughs> you can so, say greasy. <laughs> no, I'm not <laughs> um, She's my cousin, so if I'm a little too rough, I don't... <laughs> Care. <laughs> she doesn't look like she'd be related to me, I know, but I happen to be the, the, the odd one. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna ask her to tie her hair back. Okay. Okay! Now I'm gonna prime her face with the hangover, the Too Faced Hangover RX Primer. Just a little pump and massage it into the center, going outward. So now I'm going to start the skin with some foundation. The foundation that I'm going to be using today is the Mary Kay Time Wise Matte Wear Foundation. I've actually used this in one of my videos, so if you want to see that video, go over there. <laughs> and I'm going to apply it to her face on a damp beauty buendo. Every time my mom sees me do her makeup, she thinks I'm abusing her, but, but the beauty blender is pretty soft, right? Mm -hmm. If you want to see that video, click over there and do it! <laughs> okay, I'm going to add some more because it's quite medium coverage. I'm grabbing her like this, but she's my cousin, so I'm kind of allowed. Okay. How does it feel, Sandra? Nice and soft. Oh, her name is Sandra, but I'm pretty sure I said that in the intro. <laughs> Anyways, Sandra doesn't wear a lot of makeup, or any makeup for that matter. She's pretty el natural. <laughs> Gotta get the ears. Okay, so now I'm gonna grab a little bit of the Maybelline Cover Stick in shade medium beige, which is completely broken. It looks so disgusting, but like I said, she's my cousin, so <laughs> it don't matter. And I'm just gonna just put a little bit, just a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit, cause she young. <laughs> my dad is singing. If you can hear them, I apologize right now. Okay, now that that is there, I'm going to use a liquid highlight. This is the Shimmering Skin Perfector by Becca. I'm just gonna blend it in a little bit with my other side of the beauty blender. And now I'm going to set her face with some Airspun Loose Powder. I'm gonna grab a puff and just. <laughs> just kidding. So it stays on all day. You ain't looking crazy for this graduation. What's wrong with you, girl? <laughs> so we're gonna let it cook for a little bit. What should we do meanwhile? Her eyes. We're gonna do her eyes meanwhile. <laughs> I'm gonna put a little bit of foundation on there as primer. And set it. And I'm gonna spoolie her eyebrows out. So now we're gonna work on the eyes. For a transition shade, I'm gonna use this brown shade in the Carded Bible palette and just apply it to her crease. Now I'm gonna be going in with this purple shade, deepening up the crease with it. So now with the same brush, I'm gonna go in with this dark plum shade and putting it in her outer 
outer corner. Now I'm going to go in to this Tarte Make Believe in Yourself eyeshadow palette. And I'm going to go in with a smudge brush like this, but it's good to pack on product. And I'm going to spray it with a little bit of the Milani Make It Last. <laughs> I'm going to go in with this shade Trance. It's, um, it's just like a dark gunmetal silver. Now I'm going to go back in with the purple that I use on the outer corner and blend it in a little bit with the silver. Now obviously if you're working on a client, you're not going to grab them by the head like I'm doing right now, <laughs> but I feel the right since she's related to me. It's my God-given right. So now with a big fluffy brush, I'm going to wipe off carefully all the extra powder. I'm going to contour and bronze her face with the e.l.f. contouring palette mixing these two bottom shades. Okay, let me bake really quick. Now I'm gonna bronze and contour her forehead. Now I'm going to contour her nose, starting at the root of the eyebrow and dragging it forward. We're going to put blush. The blush I'm going to be using is the Elizabeth Mott blush in peachy pink on this angled brush. <laughs> now I'm going to highlight with my Luxie 524 T brush and dipping into this shade in the Carly Bible palette, but first I'm going to spray my brush. And highlight the tip of her nose. And the bridge of her nose. Boom! <laughs> now I'm going to brush off the leftover powder. Now I'm gonna go back and finish the eyes. I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild eyeliner with a paintbrush. If you saw my last video, you know I use this product. You can click right there. <laughs> and I'm just drawing a tiny little line. So now that she has her eyeliner, we're gonna apply mascara. But before that, we're gonna curl her lashes. I just wish there were like a more appealing way to do it. It just looks like it's gonna destroy you. Mm -hmm. It's scary. <laughs> Have you seen? There's like a. I'm gonna use the <laughs> Maybelline Colossal Body Mascara. There's like a heat iron, a curler for your eyelashes. Mm -hmm. Now I'm gonna highlight her inner corner and brow bone using this shade once again. Go back in the Carly Bible palette into this shade right here and look up, please. Right in her lower lash line, just blow it up. Now I'm gonna apply this Trust From Beauty gloss. So now with the Milani Make It Last setting spray, I'm gonna set her face. And we're all done. guys so this is the final look i'm so glad that you guys saw it if you stayed till the end um thank you guys so much for watching like this video give it a big thumbs up <laughs> and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already press the bell for post notifications so you don't miss out on my next video and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys